Hello, Shelby. I'm testing my microphone. Hello. Hi. I'm playing Project Makeover. What is what is that? It's a very fun game. Okay. I'm making fried rice before we go. Do you want some? Yes. Very good. <laughs> so we got the veggies kind of warming up now. Since they were frozen, I'm going to definitely let them... Let them cook for a little bit. Usually, I have a lot more energy, but um, my friend Nick, unfortunately, got me sick. So I am feeling it right now, and it is not fun. Thank you, Mr. Her. Thank you for that. All right, so we got the got the veggies kind of warming up, and we're gonna let it do its thing on the side here and. On the other side, I'm going to go ahead and put the eggs in. And you're probably like, wow, that looks disgusting. That doesn't even look like eggs. Well, that is because I already added the seasoning in there. Now, have I ever done this? No, I actually have not. This is probably the first time I'm doing this. So for all we know, this could be very delicious or it could turn out extremely nasty. And if it does, we're going to get McDonald's on the way there. We're going to let the egg kind of heat up a little bit here. And while it's doing its thing, we're just going to go ahead and just kind of Push it to the side a little bit, do a little bit of that, a little bit of this. Yep. We want to scramble these eggs. So we're going to do that. And while those eggs are going, I'm actually going to get the rice ready. Usually you're supposed to use day old rice, but I don't have day old rice. So suck my nip, okay? Whoa. Gonna just mix the eggs into the veggies a little bit. Now we're gonna add the rice. And that should be about enough. Now we're going to add some uh, more soy sauce. I know, more soy sauce, that's crazy. Some more sesame oil. And then this time actually, because I didn't add it in the eggs, we're gonna add some garlic powder. And then with that all in there, let's get to work. Star mixing, yeah. Does this fit my macros? Probably not. Uh, but that's okay because, guys, it's not always about macros and wanting to make sure that you hit them. Sometimes you just, you just got to do what you got to do. And that's life. You know? delicious I think I'm gonna add some truffle hot sauce to mine now do I like truffle I don't know to be honest completely honest with you I have no idea if I like this or not the flavor itself is nothing astounding it doesn't make me go wow I want to eat this all the time um, but why do I keep eating it I truly have no idea I wish I had an answer uh, I think it's I think it's the guilt of purchasing it and feeling like I have to eat it now and uh, yeah that's pre that's that's pretty much it let's plate it up I'm gonna try and eat as much as I can I don't have the biggest appetite right now but I'm gonna try and eat as much as I can so I can take some medicine and get over there not feeling like I'm gonna die that's the plan it is angled you guys like that canted canted angle? Bonus points if you know what canted means. It's a cinematography term. I bet my friend Elijah would know what that means. And like I said, truffle. I'm just gonna add uh, a couple dollops. And like I said before, I don't know if I like truffle, truthfully. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm a fan because uh, it tastes kind of weird. But here is the dish it looks good from the exterior and then just a little bit of truffle hot sauce but since I'm sick I don't think I can actually smell this <coughs> don't look at my toes please I'll give this to Shelby I doubt she's gonna eat this whole thing though Shelby yeah. here you go 
You don't have to eat at all. Yay. But I just made it really fast, so we can eat something before we go. Yay. Here we are. We got the dish. Uh, it doesn't look half bad presentation-wise, honestly. Looks pretty good. So I'm gonna mix the truffle in there, get the hot sauce all marinated. First bite, here we go. It's not bad. I mean, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't yummy. It's seasoned good. The rice is good. And, um, it's nice and spicy, has a kick, you know? So, of course, it's, it's going to taste good. Um, but I definitely do feel like the missing factor of, a, like, a specific protein, like chicken, kind of plays a... Plays a, plays a big play here, you know, a big factor, so that kind of sucks, but for what it is, yeah, that's pretty good. What I plan to do now is that now that I have my camera, I have the microphone, and I actually made this purchase, uh, I want to film more. I want to make more content. <clears throat> I think for later today, I'll probably use my phone and record off of my phone. Uh, and this thing apparently works on phones, which is amazing, by the way. That is so cool. So, I'm definitely going to do that. I have a hunch that we're probably going to go eat at Portillo's afterwards. So, I'll do a little round of interviews. Try to get what people think about the play and whatnot and see how they feel. And then, and then we'll go home, I guess. I'm not sure why I have this wallpaper. Look at this photograph. I think my friend set it up and I just forgot about it. <laughs> shout out Nick and shout out AB. Shout out Nick especially, you dumb f You got me sick. Just about finished that bowl. Bada bing. If I had to give it a rating, I would give it uh, I give it like a seven out of ten. It needs like it needs like pork belly or chicken. Yeah, good. Also, peep this sweater. Mm hmm. You got Kurama on the back. Naruto related. Now, am I into Naruto? No. Uh, but I'm in a shower now, uh, so that means I'm gonna get naked. Uh, right now. Oh, before I get naked, I forgot to ask my sister what she thinks of the dish. Shelby, on a scale of 1 to 10, what did you think? It's pretty good. I think... That's not a number. Oh, it's recording already. Wait. I'm out of the shower, and now we're gonna get going. Shelby, are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, she is. I'm gonna do two layers, because I'm sick. And I don't want to get more sick. So I have my undershirt. He has his undershirt. <laughs> the fit. It's just everyday, everyday wear. Oversized tee with cargo pants, and they're both from Uniqlo. She's doing a runway, guys. I'm ready. Am I even in the frame? Okay, there we go. Introducing Shelby Cook! Ew, why you walk like that? <laughs> so we are on our way now. We're going to go to uh, the show. Uh, it is a 40-minute drive. I was supposed to be there by 6.30, and I'm 10 minutes late already. Love that. So, see you guys there. Shelby, anything you want to add? No. No. There he is. There's Aldrin. You know, it's St. Patrick's Day, and he's wearing red. Say hello to the camera. I got a new mic. You guys are probably curious as to what actual musical we are going to see. But we're actually watching Shrek the musical. And it's Aldrin's younger sister, Orin. And she's actually playing Dragon. Uh, so here we are. Kind of showing you what we're looking at. Uh, my friends are here. That's Aldrin, Elijah, and Adam. And my sister. And Aldrin showed me his wallpaper. Which is always me. Gotta love a homie who supports you, man. Two hours later
This is a very popular girl. I don't know what that's like. Guys, now that we have watched the show, how are we feeling? Really good. Okay. We're, we're feeling really good. We're feeling really good. How are you feeling after the show? Uh, hungry. Oh, yeah. is hungry. <laughs> yes. How are you feeling after the show? Hungry. Okay. After the show, after, <laughs> after, the, after watching the show now. Listen, I look like I went to prison. After probably sitting and watching this show now. So now that we've watched it, how how we doing? Hungry. Oh, hello guys. Hello guys. This is Inho. I'm here with the dragon of the show. Uh, Miss Dragon, now that the show is done, what is, what is the hardest? <laughs> Miss Dragon, now that the show is done, what, what is like the most, what did you find? Yes. All right. Thanks for watching. Okay. If you follow me right this way. If you follow me right this way, oh, here she is now, Miss Oren Brionis, aka Dragon. Uh, I how you feeling? Get them out of my head. Hello, Anyaseo. Um, Come up with something other than that. Okay. Hi, I'm Dragon from CLC production of Shrek the Musical. Joking. I'm joking. Hello. Here we are at Portillo's. Now, a lot of you guys probably don't know what Portillo's is because you don't live in Illinois, but Portillo's is probably the best burgers and pasta and chicken sandwiches you'll ever have. It's really good, actually. <laughs> what, are you, what are you guys going to get? while I order. Uh, or bad, what is the uh, dinner you're going to have now that you are finished with the play today? A hot dog with cheese fries and a co <gasps> Coke. Coke. <laughs> she said what? She said what? She said what? She is in high school, by the way. This is me minding my own business. Hey. So what are you? Doing? <laughs> what? Wait, who am I supposed to be acting as? A uh, random bystander. Oh, so why is she mad? Well, I, I oh. kind of yeah, walk in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got punched. Oh man, I wish a random yeah, bystander would come by so I can ask him questions. Uh, oh man. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Please have a seat. Okay. <laughs> we we seem to have this person here with horns. Uh, I believe they are. Oh, what the heck? The, if we have to describe her, we would. My question now is, uh, what do you think of that? Are you so? Do you support it or are you against it? What? Uh, what is furry? Wish there was a. Wish there was a bystander. Excuse me, sir. Come sit over here. I got an onion ring. I got chicken tenders. Put in the dip. Four cups of dip. Food just flew out of my mouth, dude. First munch. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be so. It's gonna be gold later. Why does he look like that? Oh. It's alright. That's not what I was expecting. I'm gonna eat now.
What are your thoughts on the play right now? I th I'd like I like it a lot. I I think it's really good. And uh. Oh. 